Hello again, um, and welcome to this page. Thank you for joining me. Uh, I'm Susanna Hirschog. I'm a psychic and a medium, an intuitive coach, and a healer, teacher, therapist. And I'm here to bring you three messages using my cards. Now, if you are new to this page, special welcome to you. And then if you are not, then you are just um, joining us. So thank you very much for being here. Now, the card I'm going to use is the these cards here, yeah. John Holland Psychic Tarot cards. And these are just very quick messages here for you. Okay, so as you know, put your feet flat on the floor, feel comfortable in your body, take a few breaths here, and uh, bring your question forward and just let it drift outwards. So we are just observing that question. Okay, feet flat on the floor, and I'm going to bring you three cards, and just choose one card, okay, so it's going to be one, two, or three, and please listen to what we are given in this very moment, okay, so three cards and three thoughts, so you have a question and choose one card, so here we go, okay, number one, number two, and number three, Right, I'm hearing my chair here as well, okay. <laughs> okay, so if you are choosing number one, num card number one, okay, so I'm, I've got number one here, two, and three. Now, for the number one, without looking at it, what I feel, I need to do my flips, and I need to, it's the, for me to generate the energy in my body and in my, in my system, I just have to gather, I just have to prepare myself. So what Spirit is saying, if you are choosing number one, that you need to just maybe speed up that preparation time and then just take that plunge, what you need to, what you need to take. And because once you are in the flow, nothing and nobody can stop you. And this is what your, where your soul wants to be, or your soul really wants to enjoy that movement. There, okay. So let's See what number one we have here in uh, number one card number eight which is uh, the power the strength so you got the strength here we go and I just remember once you are in that in that uh, in that motion there okay nobody can stop you nobody and nothing can stop you and then I feel that now you are gathering this strength is going to take you forward in December and into the new year okay and then your only focus is now once you have that energy generated to to look above and then look look further above okay so that right now you are just uh, generating that energy Okay, so that flipping and then keep moving, keep keep generating as if putting putting wood on the fire. Okay, so that's the energy what I feel for you. So number one, okay, the number two. If you have chosen, if you are chosen, if you have chosen number two, I'm feeling a little hesitation here, as if I want to. I can't. I have not really made up my mind. I want to go to the left or to the right, and I'm taking a few steps back and taking those steps back, the steps back, and then the other direction as well. And what Spirit says, you know what? Just drop the whole conversation. Just drop all the mind conversation there, and then just sit back. You know, there is no. Yes, you might feel that things are urgent around you but then things are not as urgent or or life-threatening or, or or crazy as you think okay energetically speaking not the big conversation but energetically speaking around you okay so you could benefit <clears throat> you will benefit more from the whole situation just by sitting back feeling your the easiness in your maybe in your stomach area you know the abdominal area and then just breathing and at the same time, giving it away, giving it away, giving the conscience away, because there are certain things we can do, and up to a certain level we can do things. But then, if you are choosing, if you are choosing number two, I feel that your conversation is: yes, you have done things. Now you step back, stop panicking, okay, stop worrying, and then just give it, give it away. And then while you are giving it away, then be open to, to, to receive, accept, and then to receive, ha receive help, okay? Number two, <clears throat> disruption. A card I'm getting for you is number two, disruption. <clears throat> it's very much like uh, what was said, you know, you want to go this way and that way, and an inner, that's an inner, inner fight, an inner, inner tension, okay? So those blocks will melt when you give up, 
that you want to um, to know and then to fix everything and then you, you even in my mind I'm thinking in blocks okay so you just give that one up and then the, the blocks will melt like ice melting this is how I see okay and then allow the energy to flow for you if you are choosing number two okay now if you are choosing number one sorry we had no we had number one we had number two <clears throat> and number three now with number three, I'm seeing a, a windmill here, <clears throat> and while I'm picking the card, it wants to go flat, and it's going. It wants to go around and around, and I'm noticing it is moving. Uh, let's see, that is anti-clockwise for me. Anti-clockwise. I feel that time conversation. If you are choosing number one, time is an issue for you, <clears throat> and because I'm also seeing this card turning into a clock, an alarm clock, or some kind of clock where I want to uh, set the time, but I want to. I'm I'm, I'm winding the clock anti-clockwise, you know, like anti-clockwise, which is the, not the natural way to do. So what I feel is like I'm, I'm getting a little tense about time. And and then I know why uh, there is only a certain certain um, uh, level I can I can I can turn I can turn the the or try to try to um, wind the the clock. Otherwise, <coughs> it might snap. So <coughs> excuse me, it might snap. So I just have to be careful how much I'm pushing those boundaries there. You know, it, it feels like you know when we are tuning up a guitar and we are just about snipping. The, the the string okay so what spirit says you just drop it because actually you have to unwind it but not immediately that you drop it and it's very quickly flips itself back <clears throat> but then you just have to be on guard and then just allowing it yeah i also feel that you might be a person who's who's trying to control things you know and then you don't want to let the control out of your hand because if you let it go, then it just goes out, just flies out of your hand and it causes chaos. That might be a concern of yours, okay? So just have a little little step, little step. So if you are a person who likes controlling, just be patient, to your, be patient with yourself, okay? And just experience with this, what it would feel like letting a little control off my hands and then letting things off my chest as well. And possibly you need to create teams to do things, yeah, okay? So let's see the card. Prosperity begins, yeah, here we go. So prosperity be begins. <clears throat> Everybody has a seed, you have that seed, and prosperity begins when you start sharing it, <clears throat> coming from that space. And then just notice, you know, just like the seed and just like this plant, we never know, we can never know what, uh, what that plant will look like once we put the seed in the soil. We just have to, we, we just need to be patient and then just allow, that's out of our control there, okay? So once the seed is in the ground, nurtured enough, and it's going to create itself, you know? It's out of our control. So if you have chosen number three, that is your message for you today. So here we go. Thank you very much for joining in. I have used the John Holland Psychic Tarot cards. I just found me. These cards found me. I hope you enjoyed it. There were three cards, three thoughts. Um, if you feel like this is interesting or fun or or maybe useful for somebody, could be useful for somebody, this kind of conversation, just please feel free to share. And it's also, if you are watching on YouTube, uh, make sure that the comments go on my Facebook page. Uh, both both pages, of course, um, public places, public public places. So we just need to be, we just need to be mindful about how much you are sharing about sharing about yourself or your 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 life in the comments. But I always very welcome any comments here. So here we go. Thank you very much, and um, sending you lots of love and many blessings. Bye for now. Thank you. Bye.